pops off at the camera. Nah, nah, I, <laughs> nah I mean, I'm just like, dude, I've been hearing it about for like 10 years, you know, since right. I was in 92, the whole thing. It, I, I think, man, it's like, I don't really think anybody owns anything in this world, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But it's like, if you're gonna do it and you're gonna step up, just do it good and do it with taste right. and do it true to the art and there you go. You now know? I heard this new title I haven't never heard of before called Rapcore. Is, uh, that, is that what y'all consider yourselves? I, I heard this for the first time the other day and it was like, Rapcore? Nah, you know, people just make up their own things, you know what I mean? We, it's hard to say, man. <laughs> There's all kinds of it's different things. It's hard to say, know? like, it's just like we're just... We're in a rock band that's, that's part of its DNA structure is in, heavily influenced by by hip hop and it just collides and it creates whatever Limp Biscuit is and right. it's just something that's it's, it's like a product yeah. of oh, what oh, we've oh. grown up in. You know what I mean? It's hard to label it. You know, I guess we just label it as as music that's raping the hip hop industry. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Coming back with more Limp Biscuit. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Y'all don't wanna act uh, with us. Y'all. <laughs> Why well, they don't get me to sing the national anthem at night? <laughs> it's nothing. No, yo! Rap, rap, city, city, rap, city, rap, city, city, rap, city, city. Big thing up here, holding it down, sight the sounds, Slim Biscuit! No doubt, DJ Lethal, my man Fred Durst. What up? <laughs> what hip hop artists? Why are you on the tour bus when you're not sleeping? What are you listening to right now? When you, when, when you, who are you listening ooh, to? Lately, I'm outcasting. Outcasting. Right? Outcast. Outcast. I'm really feeling that high tech man. Cloud Tally Polly. Oh, no, that's crazy. No doubt. That's definitely he. The new Jay Z is hot. No doubt. M O P. M O P. M O P. Oh man, feeling that. Feeling M O P. Okay. You like M O P? No, I love M O P. Big shout out to my man, Fame and Dan. Without a doubt. Doing big things now. With all of that being said, and everything that we've been talking about, uh, with the with the emergence of Eminem and, and you, do, do you have any any uh, view on whether or not? It's because, you know, there are going to be people out there that say it's because, well, they're white and they're doing that, that y'all sell more records is gimmicky or anything like that. I mean, I don't think so, man. I think it's like half of the people that buy, mo I say 70% of people who buy, like, Dre's album. No doubt. Are, are, those are all suburban white kids who are just like, you know, they're feeling it. You right. know? Music and, is you the know, music. If you only want to sell it in a few stores here and there in your own neighborhoods, then that, you know, if you got just record in, in, in every store in every neighborhood, right. you know. <laughs> Hip hop music is so good, man. It's like, and in, in everybody that's been born any later than 1980, mm -hmm. which a lot of these kids are out there, it's on their plate from day one, and, okay. and it moves you, and you can't, it's it's undeniable. If, if hip hop is so undeniable for me, that means there's probably millions of people, and then they might be white. Right. It's undeniable. If, if it's, it's either a part of you or it isn't. And right. if it isn't a part of you and you're faking it, you can tell. Mm -hmm. And, if, and if, it, if it just moves you and touches you and it speaks to you with that universal voice, that's when it's okay. I mean, it should be okay to like, to, to embrace it and make right. it part of you, you know, but it is not where it's from is, is not where it's like in, people like Eminem and like Limp Biscuit right now. It's like, yeah, I'm white, you know what I mean? But it touches me and it moves me. And I'm like, like I was talking about earlier, I'm a huge Most Def fan, right? But it's like no reason to attack me, I can't help it. What you're doing, I feel it like right. if I didn't feel it, I wouldn't be doing it. I promise you, I wouldn't fake it. Like I that. know y'all feeling this rap city, we coming back, Limp Biscuit, big ticket, sight the sound. Don't get gas. City the basement, big tick, Limp Biscuit in the house, sight for sound. Make sure you get this album right here. Tell them go get the album, man. Do not get this album no matter what you do. <laughs> Tell them what the title of the album isn't. That would be the, the title of this album is not Chocolate Starfish in the Hot Dog Flavored Water. <laughs> I want to thank y'all for stopping Dude, by. Thanks for having thank us here. Man. It's an honor, man. Limp thank Biscuit you so came hard through to leave. the crib. That's what I'm talking oh, about. Yeah. Sight for sounds, we up out of here. Y'all hold it down. 106 and Park is up next. Rap City, the basement. Go see Rap the tour. Rap City! I love it.